biological indicator of spring is when plants begin to bloom and produce pollen. Pollen grains are a plant's reproductive cells, and usually they're transported by organisms like the birds and the bees. But they can also sometimes travel through the air, blown around by the wind. On average, airborne pollen grains travel about 100 yards. But because pollen is extremely light, typically weighing just 20 trillionths of a pound, wind can sometimes continue to carry them for more than 1,000 miles. That means pollen from California could theoretically end up halfway across the country, tickling your nose in Kansas. And during spring days that are dry and windy, the pollen count can dramatically increase. In fact, in just one cubic foot of air, there can be more than 50 airborne pollen grains flying around. And because we inhale about 16 cubic feet of air every hour, each day we could breathe in as many as 20,000 pollen grains. And now you've been brainstormed. Sam Champion, The Weather Channel.